The English, the English, the English are best. I wouldn't give tuppence for all of the rest. They quarrel with umpires and cheer when they run and practice beforehand, which ruins the fun. Rule Britannia, Britannia rules the waves. Britons never, never, never shall be slaves. What? What are you pointing that blasted thing at me for? Get out of my face, boy. By God, you'll get a thrashing. What? Hema? What the devil do I know about Hema? Yes? Yes, well, I know I stuck a... I know I stuck a bayonet or two in Jerry's belly. Yes, ha ha, in, twist, out. Ha <laughs> ha, they don't like it, up and water. Ha <laughs> ha Yes, that was jolly good fun, yes. Yes, a bit of that, that old Fairburn Sykes. Hey, hey, cop this, Jerry. Ha ha, ha ha. Yes, yes, they don't. You know what, you know what, you know what Uncle, Uncle Adolf called that? The, the Englander Gangster Method and what absolute tosh, what absolute tosh. What would bloody old Adolf have known about calling us bad sports? What would he have known about sportsmanship? Chap didn't even play cricket. Absolute bounder. Absolute bounder. Yes, well, that takes me out. Yes, uh, Hema, yes, I probably know a bit more about it than, than I thought. Yes. And by God, there is something that's upsetting me about this Hema caper. And you know what it is? It's bloody German longsword! German longsword, I say. What's wrong with English longsword? German longsword. By God, we fought them in the war and now we're doing their bloody martial arts. By Jove. And what's this chap they're all fawning over? Johannes Lichtenau. What, what's this Lichtenau thing? I mean, I mean, what's next? Stick your John Thomas up a badger. Leave the bloody woodland animals alone, I say. By God. Come over here and ravish our woodland animals. God, don't get me started about the bloody Italians. Who's their master? Oh, oh, I'm going to go and study Master Flower. Oh, Master Flower. Oh, let's go and have tea and scones with Manta. Oh, let's go and hold hands and caper and caper through the lilies. And... Oh, it makes me sick. It revolts me. What's this? The martial arts of the Axis powers? What's wrong with English martial arts? What's wrong with English martial arts? Bit of George Silver. Get a cop, well, crack out a bit of Joseph Sweetnam. Bit of Wilde and a bit of Matthewson. Right, you want to do Longsword? Go and get Harley and Little. None of this German claptrap. By God, by God, German, yes. I mean, it's all right if you're German. It's all right if you're German, all right? I mean, if you're German, you can't help yourself. I mean, must be a must be a dreadful must be a dreadful thing for the Germans. I mean, wake up one morning and think, by God, I'm not British. I mean, what across the bear? All right, wake up one morning and think, by God, you know, I could be a respectable chap, and instead I was born German. Appalling, appalling. I don't know how they live with it. All right, that's not even getting onto those chaps who eat garlic in bed and all that other caper. Yes. Yes, well all I can say is I didn't parachute onto Arnhem Bridge with Johnny Frost in 44 just so some Englishman can do bloody German longsword. It's a disgrace. It won't do it all. It won't do it all, I say. Right, that's all I've got to say to you. You can bugger off now. Until that chap to bloody well hurry up with the port and cigars. Right, that's it. Off with you. Off with you. Yes, out of here. Yes. How's that going? Rule Britannia with marmalade and jam. Five Chinese crackers up your ass. Go bang, 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 bang. <laughs> what a joy it is to be British.